Summer is just around the corner now, and as we get ready to kick off the outdoor season during this centennial celebration for state parks, we get you back tonight talking to officials at Deep, getting some grilling and boating tips. News 8's Tina Detel has those for you. Come this weekend, the weather is going to be a lot nicer, so there will be a lot more boats out here on the river, but there will also be a lot more state environmental police here as well. And they'll be right on these boats. Last year, I believe we had um, 15 BUI arrests in the state. A word of warning. The DEEP says boaters need to be prepared. There you go. The emergency is not the time to start reading the instructions on these, so you should practice. William Sapone thought he was prepared last month when he was knocked from his boat into frigid waters. He never checked his inflatable life vest. It didn't work. I locked my arm into the safety netting that was on the boat, passed out. Luckily, a neighbor spotted his boat. The state also reminds boaters to stop the spread of invasive species. Clean, drain, and dry. And pump out your boat to keep rivers and lakes cleaner. This $67 sticker will get you into every state park all summer. Plus, there's... A special free state parks weekend, July 26th and 27th. And good news for anglers. This is a 2014 guide. They're available wherever you purchase your license. What we expect, an especially good season for black sea bass. Is Again, you do not want to wait until an emergency happens to start reading the instructions on a flare or find out <laughs> if your life jacket is serviceable. In Old Line, Tina Detell, News 8.